Ranger. New technology never used at a Super Bowl will help keep your family and visitors safe during the game in Indianapolis. Police showed off that technology today to our Crime Beat reporter Steve Jefferson, and he has a look tonight at the modern way of keeping the city secure. It's really unbelievable. Jeff Layton and his family checked out the Super Bowl Village Tuesday afternoon. They're counting on law enforcement to making sure everyone downtown is safe and sound. You always keep your eyes and ears open and uh, for yourself and other people around you. This is a rare look inside Indy's new regional operational center. It's an $18 million safety investment the city will pay for over 25 years. Homeland Security Chief Gary Coombs laid out some of the advanced technology, including a wall of 40-plus monitors hooked to more than 80 cameras throughout the downtown. Some officers will access the same information on these high-tech laptops. The officer can do it. <laughs> right in front of them and be able to see information and, and make appropriate decisions, keep themselves safe, keep the community safe. Those 80 plus cameras will allow police to see everything here in Super Bowl Village as well as everything around Lucas Oil Stadium and everything from the air. Metro will send real-time video to the operational center from its police helicopter. If something happens, the same new technology simulates how fast police can evacuate 70,000 people from Lucas Oil Stadium. Many downtown visitors, like Libby Hammond's family and friends, will probably come and go. Whatever needs to be done to make everybody safe, it's great. Never even realizing all the technology put into making the Super Bowl super safe. Metro Police will fly its helicopter during events and keep it in service the rest of the year as well. The NFL and the FBI will take over the regional operational center starting tomorrow. And, of course, we have a lot more Super Bowl stories for you tonight, including live reports from Scott Swan in New York City and our Emory Tiernan also in Boston. Now, coming up in this half hour, Super Bowl parking zones. We'll tell you how certain colors will actually help you find your car in downtown Indianapolis. Then at 5.30 tonight, we're going to walk through the Super Bowl village for you. We're going to show you all of those locations, the attractions, including the stages, the zip line, and, of course, the restrooms. And at 6 o'clock, we're going to take you inside of Lucas Oil Stadium to see how the NFL is transforming it from the home of the Colts to Super Bowl Central. Chris? Live, Dolly.